welcome to our boat and Mikkel's going to tell you something about it. Hello. So, when we see a boat in the water, we can't see the whole boat. We can't see what is underneath the water. And underneath the water is a white stripe here, that's the water line. So everything below that, we can't, cannot see when the boat is in the water. And what is hidden underneath here? It's the keel, and the keel, that's what we are going to talk about now. The keel on a sailing boat has two purposes. One, it, keep, it uh, avoids the boat from capsizing when there's power in the sail. And two, it keeps the boat sailing forward and not sidewards. So, the keel is actually the heaviest part of the boat. This is either metal or it's lead, so it's very heavy. And it's actually, the gravity of the keel avoids the boat from capsizing. So when, there are, when there's power in the sails, when the wind is in the sails, the boat heels a little bit over, but the gravity of the keel, which is more powerful than in the sails, keeps the boat upright. It can heel over a little bit, but it cannot capsize. And on the Oceans of Hope Challenge uh, boats, the, the keel weight is so heavy that they just, it's impossible, they just cannot capsize. That was one. Secondly, the keel does as well. It avoids the boat from sailing sideways. You can imagine when there's power in the sails, there is some energy trying to push the boat with the wind. But the keel avoids uh, us sailing sideways and makes us actually sail forwards. But somebody would ask, doesn't it sail a little bit sideways? Yes, it does. And you will, if you pay very good attention in, in Turkey next time, you will see that when we just get the wind in the sails, the boat will sail a little bit sideways. And then when it gets speeds, then it starts to moving forward. The draft of a boat is the distance from the waterline to the underside of the keel. Our boat is draft is 1.6 meters and uh, you can see in a sea chart or in a sea chart plotter how deep it is uh, where you sail so you will never sail uh, aground of course. So two things which is good about the keel it, may, it avoids you from capsizing and it keeps you sailing forward. Thank you for watching.